Welcome back, Allendale first graders and families. We are in SIPS lesson 34. We are going to say a word, drop a sound, and see what is left. So we're going to say squid. Drop the squ. Id. Very good. Say squ eel. Drop the squ eel. Say squ eek. Drop the squ eek. Say squ ease. Drop the squ ease. Say squash. Drop the squ ash. Very good. And our last one say squirt. Drop squirt. Very good. Nice job with that. Let's go through our um, spellings. Even though we don't have a new one, I want to review what we've had so far. I eat. Very good. N. R. Go. With go. Bo. Marble. Ah. Uh. And that one is right here. R. A. L. 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 A. A. L. Always. Apple. And our Y here or here can make an I sound or an E sound. So we have two of them. The I and the E sound. All right. Reading our mixed list. We're getting lots of different sounds on here now. I'm going to cover the ending, the ED, with an OR, T, sort, ed, sorted, SP, Y at the end, I, spy, K, A, T, S, cuts. She cuts her apple. Blah, blah. Ow. That O U says ow. S. Blouse. Ow is an ouch. Blah, ow. S. Tr. Ah. Trot. F. Er. There's our IR that says er. Th. Erst. E. Thirsty. R. Ow. The ouch, r ow, n d round, s or s or ing soaring. Okay, we have an e at the end. We know that when there's an e at the end, it can jump over and make the vowel say its name. So f. PH says F O N mm, phone. Sk U T scoot. S ow er sour. This is the word that we were working on the other day. When you have a Y at the end and you want to add your ending, you drop your Y. Change it to an I and add your ES. So this would be funny, fun, ease, funnies. Pr, ow, d, proud. Fr, I, d, fried. And again, this is dropping the Y, changing it to an I, and adding ED. Sm, L, E. Smelly. Sp. L. 
in t splint. There we are. Sk out scout. Bl bl ooms blooms. Graph, graph. There's our e at the end, jumping over. Pr, i, d, pride. H, owl. There's that owl. Sis, houses. Cl, owl. D, e, cloudy. All right, these words are getting really tricky, and you guys are doing a great job. We've been working on our vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel, syllable words. So let's take a peek, grab my highlighter here. So I have my vowel right here, the I, and my vowel right here with the E. How many consonants are in between? Two, very good. So I'm going to divide it in between the two I have fit -ness. Read it together. Fitness. All right. Let's see what we have here. I have my vowel and my vowel. What's how many consonants are in between? Two, the N and the L, so let's put a dot in between those. So now I have sun and light together. Sunlight, the sunlight is peeking through the trees. Okay, I have an A. And a Y. How many consonants are in between? Two. So let's divide right between those two. Read the first syllable. Can. Read the second syllable. D. Read it together. Candy. Some people like to eat candy. Okay. Here we go. We have our vowel. Vowel. How many consonants in between? Two. Very good. Let's put our dot right in between those two. So I have per. Very good. And haps. Nice. Let's put it together. Perhaps. Perhaps we can go for a walk later. All right, vowel, vowel, how many consonants? Two, let's put our dot in between. Our first syllable is doc. Our second syllable is tor, doctor. Put it together, you have doctor, doctor. Nice, you guys are getting good at that. We have some new sight words today. Let's take a peek. He will tie his shoes. He will tie his shoes. And our first word is tie. T I. Remember, class. When two vowels go walking, the first one does the talking. Tie. Let's spell it. T I E. Read. Spell. Read. Spell. Read. Very good. Tie. 
they baked an apple pie. They baked an apple pie. And I think you're probably noticing that in our next sight word, we have the same thing that we had in tie. Tie and pie. They rhyme. They have the same spelling. Read. Pie. Spell. Read. Spell. Very good. Tie and pie. Lie down until you feel better. Lie down until you feel better. So here we go again with the I-E spelling. Saying I. L-I. Lie. Ready? Read. Spell. Read, spell. Very good. Lie, pie, tie. Next one. The puppies are very young. The puppies are very young. And our word is young. Ready? Yeah. Young, young, spell Y O U N G. Read, spell, read, spell. Nice. Let's go through all of our words and add those in there. We have spell, read, eight. Are you eight? Ready? Read, spell, read, toe. I stubbed my toe. Read, spell, read, half. I read half the book last night. Read, spell, key. Don't lose your key. Read, spell. Door. Read. Spell. Floor. Read. Spell. Money. Read. Spell, piece. Would you like a piece of cake? Read, spell, shoe. I need to tie my shoe. Hour. School will start in one hour. Month. What month is it? Bye. Tie. 
Hi. Lie. Remember our rule at the end, the I and the E. When two vowels go walking, the first one does the talking. And young. Very good. All right, it is time for us to do our dictation. So get your paper and your pencil. Okay, our first word is sound. Say sound. The first sound we hear is a s ow. We'll get our ow card. It's going to be this one right here. Ow. Ow, o, u, sound, n, You hear that D at the end. S, o, u, n, d, sound. Number two. Boom. Say b, boom. There was a loud boom outside. So we know that first sound is a b, b. Which oo sound are you hearing? The double o, b, oo. B -o -m. And we hear a m mm at the end. B -o -m. Okay, number three, high. Do not climb so high in the tree. High. So, it's the first sound we hear. And then, I. We're hearing that I sound, that long I. It's going to be the second long I sound. So I, G, H. All three of these letters right here say I. H, I. Okay, number four. Wow. W, w. You know that's a w, w. Wha. Ow. Which ow sound? The second one. Ow. So, o. W. Wha. Ow. Okay, number five. The word is bread. Bread. So, b. B, r, b, r, e, e, ed. That's going to be an e, an a, and a d. Right here, br, e, bread. That bread was really yummy. Number six. Four. Not as in this is for you, but the number four. Like I am four years old. We know that's an F. Or. O. U. R. Four. Okay, now we're on to our sentence. Did Phil shout? So, d, d. Let's make sure we get that D in a capital. D, I, D. Another D. I capitalize my first D because it's the beginning of a sentence. D, I, D. 
Now, Phil. Phil is a person's name. So what do I need to do with that? Right, I need to capitalize it. Now, can you guys see this in my... You can't. That f sound, it's two sounds. It's the f, but also ph says f. It's been a while since we've talked about that one. So I want everyone to do a capital P, H, F, also like phone, fill, I, I, and L, F, L. Did Phil sh shout? S, H, ow, which ow is that going to be? The first one right here. Ow, t, put a T on the end of it. Did Phil shout? This is an asking sentence or asking a question. So at the end, what do we need to put? Right, very good, a question mark. Did Phil shout? Thank you, boys and girls, for joining my SIPS lesson. I hope you're all doing well. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.